Welcome to our Angular 2 tutorial. Today we're tackling a question that many developers encounter when working with dynamic data. Our viewer is curious about how to handle undefined values in an array and wants to know if there's a way to replace those with zeros using pipes. Let's break down the issue. Our viewer has an array called var all, which contains several numeric variables. However, some of these variables may not be defined, leading to empty boxes in the display. The goal is to ensure that when a variable is undefined, it shows a zero instead of leaving the box empty. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're going to be going through your questions, going through some of the answers, and hopefully finding that solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. To display a zero instead of an undefined value in Angular, we can create a custom pipe. This pipe will check if the value is undefined and return zero if it is. In the custom pipe, we will implement the logic to replace undefined values. Let's look at the code for the pipe. Now that we have our pipe, we can use it in our template. Instead of directly displaying the variable, we will apply our custom pipe. With this implementation, whenever a variable is undefined, it will now display zero in the corresponding box. This approach keeps your template clean and leverages Angular's powerful pipe system. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To replace undefined values with zero in Angular, you can create a simple custom pipe. This pipe checks if a number is null or undefined and returns zero if it is. It's also a good idea to learn how to write pipes in Angular. They are easy to create and very useful for handling data transformations. I hope that video helped find the resolution you're looking for. If it did, guys, I'd appreciate it if you could hit subscribe. Until the next time that you need more technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.